before you could reach my garden, you have to pass through this lots of foxtail grass. And right now, it is a season of flowering. It's a flowering season for this foxtail grass. Currently, we are located at Salam Street. So come on guys, let's join in exploring my rock melon plantation. So today, we're going to give you an update and we're going to have a narrative on what we did in our rock melon. So when a certain plant reach the time we're in, it has its full capacity to grow, it will exponentially grow. In fact, I am very surprised today because yesterday there is just like a considerable growth that we can be be so surprised and be so happy and today we are so much happy because the growth really is very fast you will be able to see two days ago that this rock melon is positioned to expand and right now really is like saying to the entire area that hey i'm here and, and i'm ready to expand and i have my wings and i have my vines and i am producing a lot of young tender shoots enough for me to occupy this particular area so if the rock melon this particular rock melon is actually talking I presume that's the thing that he wanted to say or she wanted to say to all of us. This one also very obvious that there is a desire on the part of the rock melon to duplicate or even to emulate others, other batches who are growing. And even though this one is struggling yet with the continuous watering, then we can expect that it will grow. I became very busy tonight on a specific activity which I can recall only my father is actually fond of doing. We call it rip wrapping and we are using the stone to put it as a support on the edge and this is what I did. I excavated the portion of the of the land and uh, mulch it here in the rock melon and I, I unearthed actually a lot of stones like this so while um, excavating I also mulch and remove the stones and arranged it properly so that it will have a line So this will, will serve as a support to our rock melon and from time to time I am going to add soil and not just soil, a healthy soil so that there is a concentration and whenever you're going to water also there is a concentration of water and witness, um, wet, witness in the <coughs> in this particular plot and at the same time since the portion of the rocks which I actually put in here would would serve as a shield on the roots as it's scattered already because once the rock is actually wet so it will also make the base of it cool and that is what the requirement of the roots of a certain plant and this time it's the rock melon you can see here I'm so excited that it will revolu revolutionize and it will grow and it will expand similar with this one I loosen it today as you can see it seems that there is um, scattered soil I actually loosen it just to allow the roots to freely 
um, to freely travel and to freely look for food wow so so far guys this is the update of our rock melon tonight i hope you are enjoying and you like what you are seeing myself i really like it especially when i see here growth i see here um, layers of growth i see here greeny or green leaves of the rock melon so thank you guys for watching